Welcome back to the channel. Sometimes upscales or generations take forever. When I'm doing that, I like to still generate, but my computer is a bit busy with, with this processing. What I tend to do is go to Shaka.ai and generate some images. This is Shaka's uh, homepage and they got some SD3 contests going. So if you want to generate some images and make some money, you can do that. If you click create, you can create a model. I haven't generated a model, but I might do that and see how it goes later. I'm going to do some image creations. You can upload an image, image title, image tags description and publish this is a bit like Civitai they haven't banned SD3 model so you can generate SD3 images if you want to create SD3 models LoRa's etc you can upload it to here these are images created by other users let's go to SD3 image contests these are the entries so far they're off two thousand dollars top prize some of these look good let's go to the ai generator these are some images i generated yesterday my logo which i updated take this and use the reference or match the model so i used architecture interior with installation art architecture laura included my original logo and this logo there's my original logo i did this and it generated this when i added this it generated this and this and this so you get 300 tokens for free you get 200 fast tokens it's actually 300 fast tokens resets once per day for eight dollars a month you get 10,000 fast tokens if you build for a year but if it's for a month it's ten dollars advanced is twenty five dollars a month and you get thirty thousand fast tokens or twenty dollars if you don't mind getting billed for the year i'm going to create an image and i'm going to use uh for you i'm going to go to here sd3 medium uh lauras are unavailable for sd3 so far if you want to create a laura for sd3 you can do that and that upload it here so we've got this image and that's the text you can click on suggestions and it gives you four ai generated suggestions let's choose this one and generate it's going to cost four fast tokens for a 1024 by 1024 image image and the base model is a default sdxl model we can change that to say an sd3 let's let's try an sd3 model and see what happens and what we get out of it okay so this is the output you can publish it to the shaka gallery add the tag for the sd3 competition and you can go in to that competition you can select the image click on uh, reference and it gives you the option to add it as a reference image here you go second image and remove that you can match the model so it takes the metadata and adds it to this okay very subtle change which isn't bad download this and open it up that's pretty decent for 1024 by 1024 the hands are messed up but that's sd3 for you and let's change this to default sdxl model let's go back to home and choose a model say fantasy real cartoon let's tr uh, let's try this ghost mix the ghost mix run model there the model is added let's add a laura let's say architecture and space design let's go with this one add that laura maybe add a second laura like this one and uh, generate the same image with that reference image still there 60 steps and it's going to cost us four fast tokens you can add a negative prompt if you want, but you don't really need to unless you want to take away certain stuff. Okay, and download this. That's what it generated, reference image. I'm guessing because of the Lauras I've added, it's completely changed the picture. Good try removing Laura. Get rid of this one, get rid of this one, and generate. This is a ghost mix fooling around version 2 sd 1.5 model okay i actually like this image i'm gonna download this and load it up this looks pretty good to me could be a scene from a science fiction movie for example okay so i'm gonna go back to this one match model it's gonna do everything there can we do ah we can't do a fix let's change the model uh try sdxl photography let's try this one and we're going to add a face hand fix F fix hand actually let's get rid of this i'm going to generate an image okay so the hands look okay let's load this up hands actually look okay since he's wearing gloves you can't really, you can't really tell Uh, 
let's try changing this to a different model of photography this one's movie quality hyper realistic generate let's see if we can fix the hands fix hand and generate hand looks better but it's not obviously the same image let's try fixed seed of one and generate a new image we've got the fixed hand there we're going to see fixed hand versus no fixed hand let's remove the fixed hand and see what it looks like okay kind of like that try create brand visual design i'm going to use a model here these old lauras let's try this lot model uh, run model you can download it add it to your favorites follow the artist we're going to run the model so that's added add a laura um, brand and visual design let's add them oh that looks handy let's add that remove the image actually let's add the image back so create a logo click on suggestion suggestion on that one let's try again keeps giving you more options to add to the prompt let's create a logo in a vintage distress style with worn textures and ornate details evoking a sense of nostalgia and heritage like a worn leather band book with a debossed logo featuring subtle muted tones and classic typography with a subtle 3D embossing effect giving the logo a sense of depth and dimensionality I'm going to use uh, similarity I'm going to take that up to 7.75 Point seven five fix floor, uh, seed generate one oh two four by one oh two four that didn't work out too well try out point two five let's change that to general reference image to point five okay actually this looks quite decent I like that You may wonder who would use a site like this if I'm out and about I guess I can use my mobile phone to generate images and then download them and work on them offline if I need to with Comfy UI or if I'm at work I don't have a GPU on my computer at work I can just run this on a browser tab all day and uh, any images that I like I can work with them afterwards or offline when I get home because obviously it's saved in the, on the website rather than your local machine let's try one more the differences between this and Civitai is that there's no not safe for work models here so everything generated is going to be safe for work if you go to Civitai and click on models half of it's like porn for adults which you don't want to be using be seen using at work that is if you still want to work there still this one I like. If you enjoyed this video, hit the like button. Link in the description. Go check out Shaka AI and do some generating. Enter the competitions and you may be lucky enough to uh, win something.